The pink city of Jaipur is the capital and the largest city of Rajasthan. It is indeed one of the most colorful and vibrant states of India. Famous for its majestic sand dunes, beautiful forts and palaces, and magnificent arts and crafts, it is one of the most visited and loved states. Also popular for its mouth-watering cuisine, Jaipur is fast becoming an important cultural hub for India. Its multicultural, hospitable and progressive nature attracts a lot of tourists from all corners of the world. It is therefore recognized and listed amongst the World Heritage Sites by UNESCO. Another major attraction of the city is the famous Jaipur Literature Festival which has globally earned a lot of recognition. Making to the list of significant events in Jaipur was the third Kalam Atma International Calligraphy Exhibition. Held from 22nd to 27th January 2013, the event took place at the Jawahar Kala Kendra, the most culturally active venue of the city. The exhibition was curated by pictorial calligrapher Ms. Kamar Dagar, who is also the founder director of Kalamkari Creative Calligraphy Trust. The trust aims at kindling interest in creative calligraphy while remembering and projecting all calligraphers who have dedicated their lives to this art form. To create unity in diversity, respecting both traditional and contemporary forms and supporting those who explore new ways to express themselves in a way that can change people's perspective about things and ideas. The first Kalam Atma exhibition was organized with two calligraphers at Jawahar Kalakendra in Jaipur in 2010. While the second Kalam Atma International Calligraphy exhibition which was held in 2012 at India International Center in New Delhi showcased the works of 12 calligraphers from various parts of the world. Mm -hmm. 
art lover and connoisseur Sri Rajiv Arora lit the lamp in the opening ceremony which was attended by a number of well known people It also featured the famous Japanese tea ceremony conducted by Jyoti Naoki Eri The third edition of exhibition focused on the arts and crafts of Rajasthan while showcasing the works of 21 international artists mostly from Asia One more significant aspect was the screening of two documentaries by the talented and sensitive documentary filmmaker Asim Asha Usman of Delhi and his group Flying Birds of India. The first documentary by Asim was titled Road Map of Yasin as a Painter and was 55 minutes long. It showcased the life and works of Muhammad Yasin, an 85 years old national award winning artist and calligrapher. Yasin's works, titled Allah, were also a part of the exhibition and earned much appreciation. Rai and Akbar Raza from Flying Birds of India group also participated as volunteers in the event. The exhibition featured workshops by the participating calligraphers including a special session with educationist Shreya Jani. Anukkar Natak ये कहाँ आ गए हम वॉज ऑल्सो परफॉर्म्ड बाई एन एंथुसियास्टिक टीम लेड बाई हुरमत अली खान एंड नकुल सैनी
The exhibition turned out to be an important cultural event, emphasizing on the importance of keeping magnificent traditions alive and sharing them across the world. जय मदावानी जय मदावानी जय मदावानी जय मदावानी चंडी काली गज माश की भगवती दुर्गी विनाशनी कल्याणी जय मदावानी जय मदावानी चंडी काली गज माश की भगवती